Mrs. Grant, Miss Williams had taken you in when you were a child. Yes. And I don't know whether there was a formal adoption, but she raised you from what age to what age? Um, I was about four or five, all the way. She's been my legal mom ever since. How old are you now? 34. You're married? Yes, I am. There came a time when Miss Williams and her daughter... You have a child? Yes, I do, you How old? 12. You and your daughter needed a place to stay. And you spoke to Mrs. Grant, and she and her husband invited you and your daughter to come and stay with her for a while until you got on your feet. So far, is that right? Yes, correct. In what month and year was that? January 1st, 2017. And when she came to live with you, was there a rent agreement? We had agreed that she would pay a minimum amount so that she can still take care of her other stuff and build her credit so that she could get back on her feet. The minimum amount was $400. Um, we never seen any of the payments, but since she had a, my little... Legally, her daughter's my sister. Since she had her, we didn't want to see them go without you know, because they didn't let me go without when I was a child. So we allowed her to stay. And, and you are not suing her not for, for any the rent. rent. No. Your lawsuit alleges that there did come a time, and that was in December. December 23rd, when we came home, there was a large hole in the wall of the bedroom where she stays at. And how did where that she, happen? Where she how did stayed. that happen, Miss Williams? Judge, I do not know how the hole got in the wall. I could not tell you. I did not put the hole in the wall. What about I, your daughter? My daughter didn't do it, Your Honor. I don't know why she's saying that I put a hole in her wall no. because I didn't do it. She didn't say that you did. Well, she I said she, What she said was, when she came home on December 23rd, there was a large hole in the wall that hadn't been there before. She didn't say who did it, but it was in your room. It was the room that you were in with your daughter. I don't know how the hole got there, Your Honor. Okay, so that's the answer. And there was an argument. Yes, and um, later I had to call my landlord. Me and my husband both had to call the landlord and explain the hole to them, in which they charged us $750. Okay. They, they also... Okay, and that was in December. Mm-hmm. And you paid the $750. I paid 400 of it because we did not have enough money to pay the rent as well as that at the time I paid for. I have this right here. Okay, that's also only part of what your case is about. Mm -hmm. At some point, you asked Miss Williams and her daughter to leave. On the 23rd, we asked her to leave where she, when we put it, when we told her to leave, she caused a big scene, which my witness, Melissa Murphy, seen that. Okay, I'm gonna get to that in a second because what you want her to do is to pay for the damaged wall, which part of it was 400 that you paid, but there's still a balance owing of 350. 350. And you claim that when she was leaving, she vandalized your car. Yes, we had left. Just a second. Okay. That's what your claim is. Yes. And you did not see her vandalize your car, but you have a witness who saw her vandalize your car. Yes, ma'am. Okay. That was on the 23rd of December. No, the vandalism was on the 27th. Was she gone on the 23rd, or was she not gone until the 27th? She, to our knowledge, she had left completely. But apparently, she doubled back. You mean four days later? Yes. After she and her daughter were already out? Yes, ma'am.